wasn't expecting any of this. This is so cool. Careful, I'll lead. Cool! Look at that! I want to speak with Hammond. No, this can't wait. Can you connect me to Mr. McGuire? Or no, Peter Ludlow. Please hurry. No! Look! This is Dr. Laura Oh, Sorkin. I have a bad have feeling about this. Park. I am still on the premises. Get me somebody! Mr. Parker, I do not need rescuing. I do not want the bombing waylaid. I want it stopped. What? It's not contaminated. This is a wildlife preserve. These animals it's locked are from the inside. Diseased. They are extremely endangered. You're not listening to me! Good find, honey. Laura, it's me, Jerry. Laura? Jerry, I hear you, and I'm glad you're here. This is gonna be a lot easier now. What have you been doing? We're gonna stop the bombing, Jerry. This island must be preserved. I have taken the remaining survivors hostage. There are four others, three Americans and one Costa Rican. I won't let them go unless the plans to bomb the island are completely rescinded. How dare you leverage us as pawns? We want off the island. Help us or let us go. Five people are better than one. Protesting is a game of measurable attrition. Protest? My god, this isn't a political maneuver! You're putting us in danger to serve your own agenda? We deserve a chance to survive! Think about Jess, Laura! This isn't something you want on your conscience! I'm sorry, Jerry. I need you here. Billy, will InGen stop the bombing? Doubt it. InGen is not the one dropping bombs, it's the US military. And the contingency is based around a biohazard cover story. She may just be delaying the inevitable. If you don't offer me some sort of guarantee that the island will be preserved, I will have to escalate matters. This is lunacy! Fine, put the military on the phone. Hello? Hello? You want to see contamination of the global ecosystem? Laura, there are other options here. Holding us against our will to save the dinosaurs is only one poorly thought out solution. You're smarter than that. I know, Jerry. I know what I'm doing. I clearly express the consequences of threatening this island. I scored a line in the sand that has been ignored and trampled over by InGen, by the government, and now I exercise my resolve. Laura? I'm going to free the Mosasaur. Are you mad? A land dinosaur paddling to the mainland is one thing, but you're talking about releasing an apex predator into over 70% of the global ecosystem. It's only one. It can be recaptured. Before it eats the last of the humpbacks? Oh, don't be dramatic. Laura, don't.
Plan B. island and the scientific treasure it holds, I have been forced to take an action. It's not too late. We can reverse this. No. I locked the system down. There's nothing you can do. I've opened the gates and the Mosasaur is free to leave. Laura, you have to- No, Jerry. This isn't up for debate. We have to show InGen- Look out! <gasps> Everybody, be cool and stay away from the window. Be cool? That's right. What? You want an I told you so? I don't know about you, but I came here to make a phone call. Hello, this is William Yoder, ID 4122. Put me through to Haskell. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The U.S. Embassy. Report as follows. The island is completely overrun. Alpha Team killed in action. Save one. Myself. Bravo Team killed in action. Two helicopters disabled. Two civilian casualties. I have access to a seaworthy boat and I will evacuate the remaining survivors. Yes, sir. The military may proceed. 90 minutes. Understood, sir. What's happening? Who did you call? That's far enough. What? You're not coming with me. There's going to be a tragic accident, Jerry. Nima, we have everything we need. We're finishing this without them. What? No. What do you mean, no? We've got an agreement, remember? Our agreement doesn't involve killing Jerry and Jess. What's going on? I'm sorry, Jerry. I was sent here to retrieve dinosaur embryos from InGen. I... I don't understand. You're... you're a corporate spy? Yes. Damn it, Nima! I trusted you! It's not like that. Yoder took the can. He wants it for himself. I'm trying to help you and Jess. What can? A can of shaving cream. It has a compartment to smuggle the embryos off the island. Damn it, Nima. You're blowing it. No, you are. Oscar put his faith in you. He may have been a devil, but he wore his sins on his arm for everyone to see. You, you are just a mask with nothing behind it. No, you can't do this! Don't you care? Don't you care about Oscar or Decap? That's enough! Everyone stay back! I'm gonna give you a sporting chance here. Billy, Once wait. I let go of the spoon, there ain't no coming back. Don't do this! Run! Thank <laughs> you. 
Is anybody hurt? Is everyone all right? You mean, besides being trapped in this bubble by that desgraciado, we're as good as dead. Don't say that. Somebody might, somebody will come for us. Oh, Jerry. Yoder left us here. He'll take the boat and not tell anyone about us. Maybe he won't take the boat. He has the canister. He knows where the boat is. He, uh, doesn't have the canister. What? I'm sorry. I promise not to steal anymore. Okay, but... that one's a freebie. Jerry, look! Oh, great. Just great. Why is it flooding? Must be the damage to the door. We're losing air pressure. This place will flood right up to the highest hole in the room. Damn it! Even if we could open the door against the pressure, the whole rotunda is flooded. There's nowhere to go. Wait a second. I remember. Maybe there still is a way out. If we swim. Swim? swim? We won't make it 20 feet with that Mosasaur swimming around. Maybe. Look at that pipeline. It leads out of this lagoon. There are caves at the far end. Those caves connect to others that lead back to the beaches. We use the pipeline as cover. And you think we can hold our breath the whole way? Dad, look! There's diving here! No, 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 no. We don't know the first thing about scuba diving. I do. What? We have to distract the Mosasaur. Figure something out and meet us back down here. Scuba diving? Come on! How could this be so complicated? I don't know thing one about diving. Dad, don't mess with the mixture valve. They're all preset. Since when do you know about diving? Remember those lessons you wouldn't let me take? Did your mother override my decision? Um, actually, Steve bought me lessons. It was a secret. Mom's boyfriend? Yeah. If it's any constellation, I got grounded and Steve slept on the couch for a week. Are you sure about these sea caves? I used to swim this lagoon as a child. With the air tanks, it'll be easy. Famous last words. Pardon? Nothing. How are you holding up, Jess? Okay, I guess. I'd feel a lot better if you weren't trapped in the bottom of the lagoon. Don't worry. We're going to get out of this. We need the wetsuits. The water should be warm. This deep, and this time of the day, we would totally go hyperthermic. Don't worry, Dad. Neoprene makes everyone look good. It's not my modesty I'm worried about. Wonder how long it'll take for this room to flood. Let's not find out, Dad. I'll be right back. Feeder program. Hatchery B, Pool 4. That looks like the one scheduled for today's feeding. It looks like they purge feeder tanks into the lagoon to feed the Mosasaur. There must be a specific tank scheduled and stocked for each day. How do they expect to herd this creature? Sound? Food? Light? That ought to keep it busy. Okay, Hunt, what do we do? Dad, I changed my mind. These are rebreathers and I've never actually used one. I'm not ready for this. Hey, you can do no. this. No! What if something goes wrong? I don't want to do this. I don't want anyone else to get hurt. Sweetheart, look at me. You were right about me. I don't give you the trust you deserve. I don't give you a chance to prove it either. But here, now, you've done more than enough to earn that trust. I know you're capable of great things. I trust you, Jess. I know this is something you can do. I just... I just don't want you to go away. I'm so tired of you always going away. I know, honey, but I'm here right now, and I'm not gonna leave you alone. I'll be here with you all the way. Now, what's the diver signal for okay? It's universal, duh. All <laughs> right, right, well, I promise to signal you whenever you check on me, okay? I'm scared. 
As scared as that time you accidentally walked into Uncle Wallace's room while he was washing his nose? It was so gross. I didn't know it was, like, prosthetic. Okay, Jess. You ready? Yeah. Let's do this. So, how do these things work? Well, these are closed circuit rebreathers. They look custom designed. This is the regulator. It's built into the mask. It wants to help you breathe. Don't fight it. And don't hold your breath. Okay, don't hold my breath. The tank is small, maybe 15 minutes of air. Is that enough? But it recycles the air you exhale. It should work for about 45 minutes. Try not to freak out, you use air faster. You might even mess up the CO2 scrubbers. That sounds bad. CO2 poisoning is totally bad. That's it. The suit's mostly automated. It'll keep you, like, buoyant and manage your oxygen. Oh, and try to swim casual. Swim casual? Don't spaz out. It attracts sharks. What about mosasaurs? Probably them, too. Turn around. <laughs>